already, my king. Betrayed, my king. Texas knows of the path behind the mountain. They are coming. <laughs> Bye. 
by dawn, you will be completely surrounded. We are Spartans. When are we not? Spartans. That word will mean nothing when Xerxes wipes your bloodline from the face of you. Today was a day the Persians will never forget. Tomorrow is a day the world will remember. Finally. Big, Layla, did you really? Okay, so worth noting, I've made some changes since you were last in here. <laughs> There's no keeping up with the tech industry these days. I can crank up the simulation to maximum sensory synchronization if you're up for it. Let's take this one step at a time. Understood. If you're looking for something a little more intense, I can always adjust the settings for you later. This bit will let me know how much information will be fed to you during your time in the Animus. to worry about me. I've got this. A little autonomy never killed anyone. At least, I don't think so. Just let me know if you need assistance and I can always add the helpers back in. Listen, Layla, before you go off, if this book is right, this beer, this story, it will change everything. You're putting a lot of faith in a fairly unreliable source. Historian or not, this guy wrote about magical objects and the will of the gods. He's not Homer. Irodotos was the first recorded historian, so there's a lot more truth in that text than you think. I mean, what better way is there of finding Isu artifacts than by trusting in the guy who claimed to meet an actual descendant? I know, but I need you to trust me. You could be right. This spear, this book, it could all be crap. But something tells me it isn't, and I'm certainly not gonna let Abstergo find out first. You're right. We haven't got much to lose anyway. There's just one small problem. What is it? This manuscript is in rough condition, to say the least. The DNA found on the spear has identified two different individuals. You're going to have to pick which strand of DNA to pursue. The choice is yours. He will lead us down the right path, I'm sure. All right, boss. We're finally good to go. 431 BCE, here we come! The start of Peloponnesian War. Good luck in there. No pressure or anything? But we're all depending on you. Abstergo isn't gonna win this time. If what the book says is true and we do actually find the artifact, the assassins will finally have a chance to rise again. You can do it! Oh, and Victoria? Read the book. It holds the secrets I won't be able to find on my own when I'm in there. Aye, aye, Captain. I think it's... Get down here! 
Cyclops got a message for you. Tell your boss he can stick it. That's for last week. Malaka. The Cyclops said you like to act tough. So act tough. Get a little closer and I will. You should know by now. The Cyclops always collects his debts. You have a lesson to learn. Last week? <laughs> this shit happens every week. <sighs> I can't keep doing this. <whistles> nah. Thanks for the warning. What happened to you? It's nothing, Phoebe. All taken care of now. The Cyclops again, huh? Hasn't he learned his lesson yet? Apparently not. Of course. Help yourself. You hungry too, Icarus? <laughs> Do you think Zeus will bless me with an eagle like he blessed you, Alexios? Maybe you could ask him for me. I'll try to put in a good word for you. Finally. So, what are you doing here? Oh, I almost forgot. Marcos is looking for you. <sighs> what does that weasel want now? Don't know. He wants you to meet him at his new house. On his vineyard. Wait, what? A vineyard? Malaka! It's on the road to Sami. He says wine will make him... Since when has he had a vineyard? Yesterday, I think. So, Marcos, who owes me drag me, is buying vineyards. With what money? I don't know. Where can I find Marcus's new, beautiful estate? You know the statue of Zeus on Mount Ainos? It's south of that. Well, I guess I owe Marcus a little visit. Thank you, Phoebe. <coughs> I'll go tell Marcus you're coming. Fun's over. Tell that one-eyed freak, if he sends you here again, I'm going to cut his other eye out and feed it to my bird. I'll see Marcos as soon as I'm dressed. I'll have to go up top to get dressed.
There you are. Let's see what you've gotten yourself into this time, Marcos. Yes, this is the vineyard. Straight ahead. You, you you can't do that. Why? It's my farm. I can plant what I want. The grapes will die here. All of them. You have to forget what you know about the past, my friend. Together we will revolutionize winemaking. Believe me, you will look back on this day and... Alexios, thank the gods. Phoebe I found you, you in time. About grapes. I can't still hear you. I was worried sick. The Cyclops sent his scum to find you. I think they mean you harm. I wish you would have told me that before they hit me. But that's besides the point. You bought a vineyard, Marcos? A vineyard? Why not? I like wine, you like wine, everybody likes wine. Everybody buys wine. Why not from me? Because you don't know how to grow grapes or make wine. I'm a fast learner. You grow grapes on the vine, then you get some wine. Oh, it's that simple, is it? You know me better than to think I don't have a plan. Marcos always has a plan. All right. Then do you have the money you owe me? Do I have the money I owe you? Of course, of course. Well, no, not at the moment. Then get it. Instantly, my friend, instantly. But uh, maybe you should do that. There is a merchant in Sami. I'm not very good at these things, as you know. You want me to collect my own debt? It's just waiting for you and Sami, my friend. Who's the merchant? Luris. You know Luris. He's very nice. Luris. <laughs> Again? Why do you keep lending him money? He's a loyal friend. I don't want his family to starve. You're a good friend, but you're bad with money. How do you want to handle this one? Not like you handled that olive oil business. That was... Uh, that was too much. <laughs> I got the money. And now we'll never get any more from him. If you kill them all, nobody benefits. Threatening them and maybe more. Breaking things? Certainly. Steal the money if you have to, but don't rob me of my customers. Unless you can't avoid it. These things happen. Where can I find Duris? In a shop in Sami, overlooking the docks. You know this, Alexios. Will he be there? You mistake me for the Pythia. I couldn't possibly know. He'd better have my money, Marcos. I'd hate to have to sell our vineyard. Of course he will. Oh, after, there's another matter I want to discuss with you. After. Fine, but I'm taking a horse. 
It's too hot and too long a walk to go on foot. But think of it as interest, Marcus. Everybody benefits. Of course, my friend. You shall have your pick. About this one. The Skiros. You have an eye for sturdy stock, my friend. That horse can cling to mountain passes like a god. The one in the middle. Tell me about it. Ah, you have picked a beauty, my friend. That horse is from Thessalonia, bred for its courage. I like the look of the one on the right. Ah, the Macedonia. These are bred for battle. A true warrior's horse. I've made my choice. Which one will it be? That one. On the right. Ah, uh, a, a fine choice. But this particular breed has a few quirks that you might not be aware of. I wouldn't want you to take an unworthy horse. Maybe I should have another look. Choose wisely. The one on the left. Eh, uh, that one? Maybe I should have another look. Choose wisely. I'll take the one in the middle. Eh, uh, that one? Maybe I should have another look. Choose wisely. That one. On the right. Eh, uh, that one? This is the one I want. Are you sure? Because... I'm sure, Marcos. Everybody benefits. Especially you. You've chosen the great Phobos. He's never let me down. Phobos. Remember, meet me at the temple in Sami when you have uh, your money from Duris. Ah, f -terpy. There's plenty of wine left to buy. Don't fret. Not now, you fool. Phoebe has been taken. By who? Thugs of the Cyclops. Who else? Snatched her right off the main road. Tell me where they went. In the direction of Itimena Beach. The beach? Can she swim? I'll get her. Yes, go. But don't forget about dear Duris, Alexios. Hey. <laughs> Come on! those ropes. She'll make good ransom drachmi for the Cyclops. No one's gonna buy me from you. They're all poor. Keep quiet, Phoebe. Huh? It's tall grass. 
Ross will keep me hidden. The rest of those malakas get away. Huh? I heard something. to be next. Are you all right? It wasn't so bad. Last time they put a cloth in my mouth so I'd stop biting. Phoebe, just be careful. You're alone now since... Since my parents died? I'm okay. I've got you and you've got me and Marcos. We're your family, right? You'll have to be stronger than that! Talk him in! Let him have it! Got you! <laughs> Again! Up! Yes, Buffer. Spartan rises as soon as they have fallen. Ready your stuff. Widen your stance. A soldier grounds themselves. Hmm? Good. Good. Huh. Approach me. Ah! That's enough, Nikolaus. The sun's going down. Time to eat, don't you think? <laughs> what are we eating tonight? Tonight we are having baby Cassandra. <laughs> And what a fish she will be! No, not her! Take me instead, I'm tasty! Yes, yes, you're all sweet as honey. Now, come inside. The lamb's turning black. Yeah. Lay her in bed. Yes, Pater. Alexios. You are my greatest pride. Remember that. You will bring this family to glory. Go. Right. You worry too much. <laughs> you don't worry enough. We'll be all right if we watch out for each other. Which reminds me, the thug said you should watch your back. What'd they say? They said the Cyclops put a big bounty on you. Talos the Stonefist wants you dead. Talos, the mercenary. Oh, am I ever not in trouble? Better get him before he gets you. I hear he's really mean. I'll find my way back to town. Here! Talos the Stone Feast? That's just what I need today. 
Another broken nose. I'm going to have to take care of that. Let's go. Come on. Sammy, Nuris will be at his shop. Yeah. <laughs> 
business looks good. Tell Marcos to come down here himself if he wants his money. Huh? No, but I'm here now. Look, I was a little late paying. Now Marcos says I owe him double because of interest. I don't have it to spare. You should have thought of that when you borrowed Drachmi, Duris. But my family... It's hot. I'm in a bad mood. And you're going to pay. We both know it. The question is, what do I break first? You or your merchandise? You told Marcos I've paid enough already. I won't bow to, to, to a mercenary or to someone foolish enough to borrow money from the Cyclops. From the Cyclops? That's how he bought his vineyard? Look, I know you'd be dead without Marcos. What with him taking you off the street as a kid. But you know what he's doing is crazy. You're right about that. Forget the drag me. Marcos and I need to have a talk. You're letting me go? Then at least take this sword. Nothing special, but it's better than that rusty one you've got. With the Cyclops involved, I'll need it. You better set Marcos straight or you're both dead. What can I show you? I'm glad you stopped by. Now. Mighty Kefalus, I entreat you, send us a champion, someone worthy of your mighty spear. Help your priestess in her hour of need. You called? <gasps> oh, Alexius, you startled me. Why are you looking for a champion? I need someone worthy to win the spear of Kefalus. I've been deciphering some of the sanctuary stone carvings. They say the spear was hidden in the caves beneath Kefalonia when the temple was built. You could get it for me, couldn't you? I can give you a reward. If the spear is in the caves, I'll find it. Well, maybe you were sent by Kefalus. Kefalus had a spear? Alexios. Surely you've heard this story since you were a child. I didn't have much time for stories. Well, perhaps you didn't. But you know Kefalus founded Kefalonia and started the line of Odysseus. His spear was a gift from the gods. It was said never to miss its target. He must have hidden it in the caves after killing his wife with it. He threw a spear that wouldn't miss at his wife? He was hunting and heard her in the bushes. He thought she was a deer. It's a sad story. Sounds dangerous. Well, only if you throw it at someone. Why do you need a spear? Not thinking of becoming a soldier, are you? Of course not. But think how many people will come to the shrine if we have the spear of Kefalus. With their donations, I could do so many things. Repair the sanctuary, feed the hungry families in Sami. So where is this spear? Apparently, it's hidden deep in the caves beneath Kefalonia. There's an entrance north of here. Maybe you can try that way first. That's not much to go on. You have so little faith in the gods. If Kefalus means for us to have the spear, you will find it. I'll see what I can find. 
Oh, thank you. I'll... Επικαλούμε σε μάγκα, πολιώνουμε, πυρίπολε και τελετάχα, θεών πάτε. You're running out of time until the Cyclops comes for you, Malaka. He wants his money. Could I have an extension? When he sails back to Kefalonia, he'll come and break you as soon as he talks, if you don't get it. Now, let's be civil. You can't hide behind your glories, Mistios forever, Marcos. He'll kill you, the mercenary, and that little runt girl that hangs around. Of course, not a problem. I'll get the drachmi. Good. Or I'll come and watch the Cyclops feed you to his goats. Ah, Alexios. I can tell from the smile on your face, Duris has paid you your drachmi. Who's smiling? I just heard where you got the drachmi for the vineyard. Are you out of your fucking mind? We can get the money back, can't we? I'm sure it's possible. It'll take a lot of work. And even then, I'm not sure. We have no option but to try. Then you'd better be willing to help. I won't do all the dirty work. <sighs> I long for the old days. Remember them? They were simple. You had nothing, young and alone, and I had everything. And I gave you the world, Kefalonia, in the palm of your hand. Don't see fishes like you every day, huh? <laughs> oh. Ha. You hungry? Ha. 
How about we make a deal? I do something for you. You do a few things for me. Everybody wins. Best offer you're gonna get. Huh? Think about it. Wait! Kefalonia. <laughs> Some gift. You were nothing without Marcos. And look how far we've come. From an orphan on the streets to a Mystheos with a Havel. And now the Cyclops will take everything away. I can't protect you from him forever. He'll kill me too. Oh, don't be scared of him. And look at you. How could I go up against him? With what weapons? A rusty spear? A broken bow? There you are. Skulking around the temple won't save you from me, Marcos. Drusilla! I was just talking about you. You were? I need that wood, Marcos. These new bows will be the talk of the island. I can't make anything with those bandit malakes stopping the wood shipments. Of course you can't. Why, I was just filling my friend Alexios in on the details. He already has a plan to deal with these bandits. He's the silent but deadly type. I don't care who does it, but someone better got those bandits. Today. A wonderful idea. I, for one, uh, need to rush home. Alexios, I've cooked up a plan for our Cyclops dilemma. See me when you have time. If you want your wood, you'll have to fix my broken bow first. Hmm. I usually only pay when the deed is done, but shit's moving at a snail's pace. Follow me. These balls will make me rich as Chrysos. They're that good, are they? War's brewing. The Athenians need good bows if they want to build up the Spartans. Everybody benefits, I guess. Who are you? Marcos? You should be tired of this small-time shit. You'd make a fortune in this war. Plus, I hear you're a secret Spartan. That was a long time ago. I'm a Kefalonian. Hand it over. There you go, good as new. That bow is as strong as Heracles himself. Give it a try. Shoot your arrow at those dummies. Fair is fair. Are you going to get my wood? Those fucking bandits need a thrashing. Fair is fair. I'll fix your wood problem. Finally! Marcos sure is lucky he's got you as his scapegoat. There's plenty of trees around. Why do you need this type of wood? I've been working on a new type of bow. It's more flexible, so it lasts longer and can fire at greater range. Only a very special kind of wood that grows high in the mountains will do. Any idea where these bandits are? I'm not a tracker, I'm a boyer. They're in the mountains somewhere, that much I know. I'd check close to the lumber camps. I'll take care of the bandits. Make sure that you do. And be quick about it. 
I'll deal with these bandits and get you the wood you need as fast as I can. Have patience. It won't take long. Ha! If you knew how long Marcos has been feeding me excuses, you wouldn't be saying that. All right. I did something for you. Now you do something for me. Get my wood. Come on, come on. Ella. Sammy, I wonder if we'll be able to leave without getting into a brawl. <laughs> Who am I kidding? This place never changes. Yeah! Off we go now. Come on. <laughs> possible. I hear they can be vengeful. I used to worship Hermes at the Drogorati cave. There are gods there too, you know. In the cave? They grant wishes if you bring them tribute. So everyone makes an offering and asks for something in return. Ah, uh, no wishes of mine granted though. You know Hermes. He can be a trickster. Oh, but there are many gods in this cave, all asking for different things. Go hear him yourself. You'll get my last tribute if you do. I need to know if they're real. All right, don't worry. I'll go. Oh, thank you. Remember, be careful where you step, Mistyos. You'll be walking on holy ground. We'll see about that. Someone dropped offerings here. <gasps> Looks like they were trying to carry them away behind the statue. Ukevno TV Prati. There's a draft here. A crack in the wall. Better stay hidden. Thank <laughs> you. 
Come on.
Come on. How'd it go with Marcos? How it always goes. I didn't get my money, and I'm running another errand for him. Why do you let him boss you around? He doesn't. He just gets me into situations I have to dig myself out of. Maybe you shouldn't let him do that. Thanks for the advice. You're welcome. What do you want, Phoebe? You know Kausos? The town on the other side of the island. Why? People there are sick. And my friend Kina is too. There is a blood fever. They say it's a curse and they need help from the gods. I told you, I'm not a god. But Icaros... ...is a bird. That doesn't mean you can't help. Ah, all right. I'll look into it. Ah, here you are, and not a moment too soon. The Cyclops is more important than a boyer. We need to talk. Precisely what I was thinking. Let's hope Drusilla has a good sense of humor. Well, your plan? Right. The Cyclops and I have a score of Drachmi to settle. The same score as you, my rough and tumble friend. He wouldn't be after me if it wasn't for you, my friend. <laughs> eh, right. But I swear, this will put an end to it. If he insists on sending his goons after us, we'll make sure his last good day was yesterday. It's not a war. It's a pissing match. You know just how to hurt me, Alexios. It's not that hard. Trust me. Think. What does the Cyclops value most? His men? His land? His ships? No, his obsidian eye. Get to the point, Marcos. Oh, fine. We're going to steal it. Are you crazy? You borrow his rachmi, then you steal his eye? Having it means we win. Then it goes to market. We kill two birds with one obsidian eye. <laughs> He'd better hold still. Or he'll lose both eyes. No, no! It has to be done without the Cyclops knowing. You cannot be seen. Then my new bow will come in handy. He keeps the eye in his house. It's too valuable to wear out. A wise choice until you show him the error of his ways. Wait for the sun to set, sneak in, and then bring me the eye. Better be worth something. Do you know how much obsidian goes for in Kefalonia? I've never seen it. Exactly. And not only is it obsidian, it's veined with gold. Gold! It's no wonder he saves it for special occasions. So we'll use the profits to pay him off. It will pay for the bulk of it. A vineyard's expensive, you know. I don't know where the Cyclops lives. Keep to the west side of the island. There you will find his lair. Fine. But you won't get away with being cheap. Cheap? You wound me, Alexios. It's your defining trait. Bring me the eye and I'll prove you wrong. Remember, not a soul can see you. Got it. Pull this off and our heads won't be the Cyclops' trophies when he comes back.
Now to find the eye. If it's as valuable as Marcos says, it will be hidden. Let's go. Come on. No gods in the caves, only bandits stealing people's hopes and drag me. <gasps> I knew it! Thieves! At least you know you won't face Zeus's wrath. Maybe he'll take pity on you. I hope Zeus brings his wrath on those bandits. Don't worry, I brought mine. That should be good enough.
Carlos. Fresh vegetables for your journey. The juiciest in Kefalonia. I'm not really in the market for vegetables. No one is. Our stock is practically decomposing. We're trying to make enough rachmi to get out of Kefalonia. I know what you mean. Wait. Creosa. You think he could help us? I think he could. You'll have to tell me what it is first. Are you scared of sharks, Mistios? I'm not scared of anything. That makes one of us. A very hungry one swims in our way of leaving Kefalonia. A shark? He guards a precious necklace. We get it, sell it, and leave Kefalonia. The old bandit who found it first buried the necklace on the shore, near a temple. And the fool didn't think. Water rises. Now the necklace may as well belong to the shark. Vegetable drachme is all right, but necklace drachme is best. I know what it's like to want to leave Kefalonia. Who wouldn't? We have nothing here. As many vegetables as we please, but no hope. It's buried in a chest. If you get it for us, we'll take what we need to get out, and you can keep the rest. All right, I'll kill your shark. You'll skewer him. You'll find him deep in the ruins of Grani down south. Buried treasure usually has a story. <laughs> the necklace was said to belong to Procris. You know, the wife of Kefalus. On the eve of their wedding, he gave it to her as a promise of fidelity. Well, we know how that turned out. <laughs> Typical. At least he returned to Procris in time for her death. Where on the island are these ruins? You know the sunken islet of Zeus? Find that, and you'll find the ruins. To the shark's temple I go. I'll never look at another vegetable again after this. Hello, I. I see you. I should stay hidden if I don't want to fight. Must be some eye to have that much protection. 
I have to stay out of view. They're not here. I don't believe it. Nothing here. Let's hope no one notices me here. Must be some eye to have that much protection. I have to stay out of view. Over there! That's where the archer is! I know where it came from! They're not here. Get away that easy! 
Come on, come on. Yeah! Hey,
Gods, what's happened here? Off we go. Come on. Ella. won't help you. This sickness must be destroyed by our hands. We have no choice. Help us! He won't let us go. What's going on? Kausos was consumed by plague. We couldn't keep up with the bodies. It was spreading. 
We had to intervene. They killed our brothers, our neighbors. We survived the massacre, but he'll kill us now. The gods have abandoned us. The sick must join the dead if we are to save the living. Is there no hope for a cure? Nothing has worked. Sacrifice. Prayers. Healers won't come near us. Soldiers won't let us leave. The gods won't answer our prayers. You burned the whole village? Many knights were lost praying. We had to take action. To scorch the blood fever out of Gaussos. But I don't know anything about the plague. There is nothing you can do. No! If you intervene, I will be forced to defend the God's wills. Save us from him! Have pity! We aren't even that sick! We'll get better! Nobody gets better! This is the only way all of Kefalonia will save itself from extermination! Please! We have children! Think of them! Don't regret stopping here, Mistios. Let them go. What? You're no god. I got something for you! God be with me. came from the underworld, some man of the gods. Oh, the real gods sent you. Time to go. We're well enough to travel, but need healing. Before you go, take my drachmi. It can't pay for what you gave us, but it's all we have. Forget about that. Just travel safely. Your gift from the gods, Eagle Bearer. I hope they bless you. Shit! 
I should take care of that. How many of his guards were there? Considering how many showed up here? Yes! What did I say about being seen? At least you taught them a lesson. All for a fucking rock. This rock could buy a house, my friend. And yet, it's still not enough to pay back the Cyclops. Oh, don't be upset. Think of all the fun we've had. Right. Your fun, my blood. You can't keep dragging me into things, Marcos. This will work, I promise you. Would I lie to you? Don't make me answer that. Take the eye, but don't sell it yet. No vendor would believe we came by it lawfully. They know exactly who it belongs to. Fine. Better your pocket than his socket. I think that's enough for one day. Here, Marcos. Uh, wait, I saw a boat. One I've never seen before. So? The vessel's too good for this dirty town. It must be the Cyclops, and he brought friends. He's back. Ugh. I can never catch a break, can I? Take them out, and that's one less thing to deal with. Besides, these strangers look rich as Chrysos. The Cyclops pays them well. It's win-win, my friend. It can't hurt. What do I have to lose? You? You're a winner if I ever saw one. Then where are they? In an abandoned house on the eastern coast. Who knows what golden fortunes shine in their hideout? Send them to Hades, then loot them for all they have. We'll be rich! The eastern coast. Can you be more specific? I think they've settled in an abandoned house. By a small forest south of Sami. So, if these visitors aren't from Kefalonia, where did they come from? All I know is Kefalonia will be the last place they'll ever see. I'm keeping some of these golden fortunes, though. No negotiations. Not even a drachme for the man who sent you? The rest goes to pay your debt. These are my terms. Oh, fine, fine. Now teach those strangers what it means to be Kefalonian. Draw blood or bleed. You're this week. 
Off we go now.
Come on.
Off we go now. The abandoned house and the people. Don't want to be spotted here.
have someone else do the field work. I don't suppose you know how to get this stain out. It comes with the territory. Then you're just the mysterious I'm looking for. A clean slaughter. Very good work. Not much sympathy for the men who work with you. Not with me. For me. Employees. Now ex-employees, I suppose. So you don't work for the Cyclops? Your kind aren't usually believers of myth. Not the monster. The man. You are an outsider. Why are you here? Indeed, I'm not from Kefalonia. I'm here because... If you'll follow me... Who are you? I'm Elpinor of Kir. How do I know your name? Tell me who sent you. An inquisitive nature. Good. But you know more than you know my... The Shroud of Penelope? A pimp. Which is... The Shroud of Penelope? A pimp. Which is... Ithaca's night started? All right. Don't expect it. That's why... Then it's agreed. There's a rowboat in the half. I will. Oh, and Mysterious don't fail. Thank you. 